Hi everyone, let's look at the Seymour EA9 HMI series panel um, powering the unit. And up, uh, up what I have here, uh, look at my hardware, is I have my series EA9, it's a, a T10 CL. I flip over the back here and what we'll find is that we have our connector located right here and we can just pop that connector out and it provides uh, 24 volt, either 12 to 24 volt. And I have a Rhino power supply here, which is rate rated for um, a couple of amps. So it's actually 2.5 amps is recommended for power ignition it up based on all the different uh, parameters we have in it. So positive on positive, negative on negative, and then we power this unit up. So we'll flip that over. And what we'll do is um, we'll plug this in now. And the first thing you'll see is our power light actually will come on. It'll actually say loading. And we'll just uh, do a little more right to it. And then one of the best things about this is this quick start guide just takes you through a couple of simple steps. So right now it's asking for the start calibration. So we touch the screen and we touch the uh, that spot, that spot, that spot, that spot. And there we go. And the settings now have been changed. And there we go, we're loading again. So there is my start screen for my Seymour uh, HMI. And now we can uh, go on and load the software. So if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button below. If you have any questions about this video, please leave a comment below and I'll do my best to answer it. If you want more information about us or you want to get uh, our free eBooks on numbering systems or robust data logging, please click on the link in the description below to get it. A new video is put out every Monday, so make sure that you hit the subscribe button so you can get more videos like this in the future. Remember to click the bell beside your subscription in order to get those notifications of new videos being uploaded. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.